Welcome to today's masterclass about unlocking the power of AI. Um, I'm Polly Barnfield and I'm joined today by Sarah Bassett, who's our Head of Growth. Sarah, how are you today? I'm very well indeed, thank you. Been looking forward to this masterclass. Exactly. Um, great to see so many people here. Um, just some housekeeping before we get started. During these masterclasses, um, we really encourage people to ask questions. But because there are quite a lot of you here today, I'm delighted to see that. We run all of the um, questions through, depends which software you're on, but through Q&A, so that you don't feel um, embarrassed to ask sometimes the simple question. I love asking simple questions because often those are the ones that get the most, um, that, that they have the most power. So rather than feeling inhibited, all of the Q&A are private. So when you hear me talking about what the questions were asked. Don't think you're missing out, you can't see them. But if you look in the on your screen somewhere, there'll be a Q&A button, or it may look like a chat icon, or it might have Q&A by it. Um, please add your questions in there and we will answer them live. You won't, we won't call out your name or anything like that. Nobody will know it's you, but you'll know your question's being answered. And some of them will answer privately as well through chat. So please don't inhibit it. Please ask questions as you go through. This masterclass is for you. Um, and you'll get much more out of it if you ask questions. So it's Q&A, um, don't try and find them. You won't see them on the screen anywhere. They are completely private, but we will answer to them to you to private as well. So please drop a, drop a yes, I get it in the, in the Q&A so you know where it is. And Sarah will be answering as we go through. And she'll also shout out to me as well if we think there's something we should answer. So thank you for joining us. Let's crack on without further ado. More and more people joining all the time. Um, so what can AI do for you? Um, you know, we've heard more and more about AI over the past 12 months, um, and I'm really excited about it. I'm just turning my phone off before some of the world interrupts me. Um, what can AI do for you? Um, I believe it is as transformative as the internet. I believe that it can all help us do something extraordinary. So let's dive right in. Um, today's agenda is about how can you reach more customers? How can you grow your sales? How can you stay ahead of your competition? How can you just generally do better business and be more efficient? Our, our, reason, our, real, our real raison d'etre this year is how can we help you do your best work faster? Um, who are we and do we know what we're talking about? Well, I hope we do. Um, I'm Polly Barnfield, I'm the founder and CEO of Maybe, um, and we've been doing this for, uh, Maybe has been in existence for about 10 years now, um, and we've helped over 25,000 businesses connect with their customers digitally. Our clients range from SMEs to PLCs, and our biggest client is the UK government. Um, our team, I think, are awesome. Um, we're here to help you, but we are used to helping a wide range of clients, whether it is helping teams um, of shopping centres run their businesses or help the you know, small SMEs through some of the work we've done with, with county projects. And um, Sarah, would you agree? We've, we've deal, dealt with an enormous spectrum of businesses. Absolutely. Sole traders, um, startups and entrepreneurs, um, all the way through to really quite big organisations, membership organisations. Um, and then, yeah, all the way through to government. We work with a lot of councils as well, but it's all about supporting businesses to get, get digital. Exactly. Um, so, uh, and the key thing is that our government contracts uh, were all based around AI. So five years ago, we were selling AI before it became mainstream. So we haven't just bolted AI to, onto what we do. It's absolutely key to um, the services we deliver. And it has changed the way we do business. Um, and this masterclass is all about helping us share what we've learned to other businesses. So who's today for? Very simply, it's for ambitious business owners and team members who want to do their best work faster. Um, this isn't going to be technical. It's about literally saying, how can we help you as a business owner get more money and save on costs? But importantly, if you're a team member, how can we help you be consistently amazing in less time? This isn't about doing more work. It's about doing better work faster. We believe that AI can help every one of us be at least twice as good as we are right now. And you know, as, as a CEO, I'm looking to make sure that my team can use AI in the most efficient way possible so that we can deliver twice the output and ideally in less of the time, I'd like everybody to have a better life and have more time to spend doing the things they love in life. But as a team member, if you get good at this, you'll be five times as good. And that means you go up the ladder faster. 
I love AI and I'm using it everywhere I can in my work. And I'm, it's helping me be better. But if I can see team members starting to do the same and my work, their output has just transformed and they haven't worked harder. They've just worked smarter. And so this masterclass and the offer we're going to make you at the end of it is all about enabling you to do the same because 5 xing what you do in less time is just the most awesome experience. Now, another thing we're going to show you, and part of the reason I believe that it's possible for any one of you on this masterclass to 5x what you do, is that AI enables us to ask an expert at any given moment. I'm going to show you today how you can stay, take Steve Jobs with you on your life as you go around your work. And just imagine if you can ask the expert in your sphere to mark your work before you present it to somebody how much better it will be. It has blown my brain what it does, and I want to encourage you to do the same. So what will you leave with today? You'll have leave with proven prompts. Prompts, if you don't know what they are, are basically the instructions you give AI. It's what makes AI deliver the magic. So you'll have access to maybe AI, which is a tool that we're developing that enables you to personalize AI, and it makes it sound like you. It means that you're never going to have to uh, use that sort of generic gray AI that many businesses are using. As I mentioned, I've got a really special a special offer for you at the end of this masterclass, so don't, don't run away. Um, I love this card team. So um, I, I, as I said at the beginning, for me, AI is as, as important as inventing the internet, but you could say it's as important as inventing the wheel. Because frankly, if you don't bolt one of these guys on right now, it's, it's goodbye, your competition is gonna leave you behind. You cannot be too busy for this. You have got to find a way to integrate it into your business. It's not about AI taking over our jobs. It's about helping us do our best work faster. So please don't be too busy for this. Choice is very simple. Your choice is which, which wheel do you want? How fast are you going to get going to go? Because all of us will have AI introduced into our lives, whether you're using Google or using Bing, um, or many products have got a little bit of AI sprinkled through them. The question you've got to decide is AI is going to be in your world. The question is, are you going to proactively embrace it and help it, it enable you to do your best work faster? That simple. I'd love to see in the Q&A whether anybody's telling me yet whether they're, they're doing this. Um, just drop in the Q&A. Remember, it is private. And nobody's, going to, nobody's going to call you out. Just let me know. How much are you already using AI or are you here to sort of put your toe in the water? Because it's a little bit, you know, it's like the wheel. It's just going to be part of our worlds. The question is, how much are you going to use it? So come on, be brave. Um, oh, it's great. See the question that the, the answer's flooding in. So yeah, I can see people saying some people are using ChatGPT. Um, some of people have, are you using it in Notion. That's interesting. Um, so please drop it in. Promise you, as you can see, you can't see what anybody else is saying. Drop in. How are you using um, AI right now in the Q&A? Um, that's great. Thank you for all those people that dropped that in. Oh, image. Yeah, that's interesting. Some people are using it for images as well. Um, so lots of ways you can use it. And some people say, no, I haven't started at all. Yeah. So look, there's a real cross-section of people on this web on, on the Masterclass today. Um, let me know how you're using it. Um, and we're going to show you lots more about how more you can use it to do your best work faster. Um, so three quick case studies um, about why um, we think this is so exciting. So I've taken two of the clients that we've worked with over a very long period of time. Um, and they've got to a point now where they've gone from doing no business online to doing six figures consistently a month through what they're doing digitally. Um, and it's all because of they've learned and they've put together lots of tools. And they're now using AI in the way they do to optimize their ads um, and the content they create. Um, and we use AI in the content we create, but also in all the automations that we deliver. You've put in, in order to come to this masterclass, you've seen our ads, you'll have had emails from us, you'll have had text messages from us. And all of those are because of the automations we can deliver. Um, now, these two businesses are both doing extremely great um, trade online, but they've had to glue together lots of processes. And a lot of what we want to show you on this masterclass is how you can use AI to not only create better content, but how you can use AI and automation to improve your business processes um, and get the results quicker. So thank you for everybody that's dropping in the post, the, the, the more people dropping in about how they're using AI. Yeah, lots of people using it for social posts and blogs. 
um, and absolutely, that's the tip of the iceberg. The content creation AI is spectacular, and we're really going to focus on on that part of it today. But there's much, much more it can do as well. Um, we're we're not making this up. We have got lots of very happy customers. Please go and look at our our trust pilot ratings if you haven't met us before, um, and you can see uh, or on our website lots of testimonials about how we've helped people. Now, for us, what we did last year with the AI is we turned it into a customer support tool for us. Um, and if you go and look at any of our um, website or you dive into our product um, and you ask us for a, a support question and 24 seven, we deliver expert help because we know that actually it's no good to have the technology you deliver is less important actually than the support you give with it. And what we've discovered with, with AI is that it is incredible for delivering first class support. And we can show you how to do the same for your business using AI. So let's get down to business. How can AI help your team achieve 80% of the output in 20% of the time? And as I said at the beginning, we've got a really special offer for you at the end of this presentation. Um, the That offer includes um, a guide which I hate to think what it's cost us to create, how much training I've been to and some of the team have been to, to create it. It's a it's a Bible of fonts that have about 150 pages in, it, pages in it right now. And it really helps you drive AI incredibly well. Um, this is the tip of the iceberg for us. We're gonna, we're gonna show you a little bit of what ChatGPT can do. And now I'd love to know, um, I can see, as you can see from the Q&A, some of you haven't even used Chat ChatGPT before. So, so some of you, that those that, of those of you that have, please don't feel like this is going to be a waste of time for you because the prompts we're going to show you help you get um, chat GPT or any other um, provider like Bard, for example, to deliver you extraordinary results. Um, but we're also going to show you how we how you can personalize this AI so that it sounds like you. And you can't do that in chat GPT without doing it with every prompt you do, but there's a bit of magic that we're going to show you, or Sarah's going to show you actually later on. Um, Sarah, thank you for answering all those questions I see pinging out. So um, um, a couple of questions about people asking around what is ChatGPT? Great question. So ChatGPT is a large language model. It hit the world last year, sort of about, about Christmas time, it started to become mainstream and it went from, I think, a million users to a hundred million users in something like 30 days. It's the fastest growing product that the internet's ever seen. It grew quicker than Instagram or any of those other services. And what it lets you do is ask, ask questions and it gives you a response based upon all of the information on the web up until 2021. And recently it had an update, so it's up until 2023. It's completely, it's just mind blowing what it will do. So I'm gonna now um, close my screen down actually and show you how you can use the prompt guide that I, uh, I mean, we're going to, we're going to send you, we, we guarantee you will send you, if you don't take us up on offer at the end of the uh, at end of today, don't worry, we'll send you a, a guide, a slightly smaller guide, but um, I'm going to show you how to use prompts and chat GPT. So this guide is, uh, as I said, over a hundred pages long. Um, you've got masses of prompts in it. Everything from, you could write a book, you got how to write a book, but not do that today. It takes a little bit too long. Um, but you've got everything from, um, asking uh, branding questions through to finance and accounting, marketing and sales, human resources, you name it, um, creating guides for photo shoots. There's so much in here. I can't tell you literally, this will save you thousands upon thousands of pounds. Now, let me show you how this works. So let's go to um, start here. Let's start with uh, creating, uh, this is a real fun one. Embrace the mindset of an elite F FBI profiler turned marketing maven. Um, and this is going to help you create a marketing plan for um, a restaurant. Actually, I, I forgot my lines today. I don't, I've, it's been a busy day. So we're going to go to chat. I'm going to copy that. But first off, we're going to get to have some fun with ChatGPT. Then we're going to, I've, got a, I've got a segue that's going to make a lot of sense. So ChatGPT can, can do anything for you. And I'm going to start with, um, I'd like to, I'd like a recipe. Or fish chowder. So it doesn't have to be business. Uh, I'd like a recipe for fish chowder. It doesn't even mind if you get the words wrong. I love that because I'm really bad spelling. So I'd like a recipe for fish chowder. So literally, you can ask ChatGPT anything. Um, so it's giving me the ingredients. 
And the next thing I'm going to say to you is actually, do you know what? I'm I'm a big Jamie Oliver fan. So I've asked it for a recipe for fish chowder, but I didn't give it a very good instruction. Do you see, I just said, give me a fish chowder recipe and it's gone off and done it. The next thing I'm going to say to it is actually, can I have this recipe? Uh, uh, how would Jamie Oliver improve this recipe? Let's see what it says. I'm excited about the answer, actually, because who hasn't got a Jamie Oliver book in their kitchen? I mean, I think it's it's I think it could almost be made law now that everyone has to have one. So I'm excited to see what it says. Exactly. So 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 I asked a fish chowder chow recipe, really simple question, boom, straight away, gave me the ingredients, took me about how to prepare it. Um, and that's a great recipe, right? Um, but I now say to it, how would Jamie Oliver improve this recipe? And as Sarah says, everybody's got um, a Jamie, Jamie, Jamie Oliver book. But I could have said, how would the Ree brothers or how would Nigella? I could ask any for anything and it will it will go off, it will find the information. And this fast, it gives the answer. This is live. Um, and this, so here you go. Use fresh seasoned ingredient, ingredients. Jamie emphasizes the importance of using fresh seasoned ingredients. You might recommend using locally sourced fish, fresh vegetables, um, yada, yada, yada. Um, lemon zest, herbs and spices, roast garlic. I can always hear his words in my head. That's so Jamie, right, Sarah? <laughs> Absolutely. I'm still reading as it's as it's typing. A splash of white wine. That's very me too. Exactly. Exactly. So you get the idea. You can ask ChatGPT anything. So let's let's extend this and take. I copied that prompt about um, how to create a marketing strategy. So I'm going to now create a new chat because I've finished with building my recipe, but I'm take that theme. So I can imagine, imagine now that I'm I'm starting a fish restaurant. Let's stick, let's stick with the theme. So here's my prompt I've copied from the um, Bible that you can access when, when, when we talk about the offer at the end of this. So embrace the mindset of an elite FBI profiler turned marketing maven. So this is taking everything to the other extreme. You remember how when I started this, I just gave it a really, really, really little prompt saying, I want fish trouder. I then improved it by saying, be Jamie Oliver. I'm now telling the AI to act like an elite FBI profiler. Now, I don't know how much training they have, but they have a lot. Imagine stepping into the world of online marketing with the astute observational skills and psychological insight honed over three decades at the forefront of the FBI profiling division. Your mission, should you choose to accept it, is to turn this unparalleled expertise into carving the most precise target market for. Um, let's give our fish restaurant a name. So what we're going to call our fish from the restaurant, shall we call it Jamie's just for the hell of it? Jamie's, yeah. A groundbreaking solution designed to um, provide um, a restaurant that serves sustainable fish recipes. Yep. So keeping keeping it with the fish um, theme but it could be anything it could be absolutely anything just think there's a couple more thing here so i'm going to give keep, uh, first your first task is a deep psychological uh, psychological ex excavation leave no stone on turn uh, the, what fears keep people awake what aspirations propel them through the day how do their past experiences shape their current desires that resonate with jamie's so the idea here is that from a marketing perspective you know you would pay sorry if an agency or a number of agencies on the on the, on the line here you know how much work this takes to do this. Um, picture, picture of where they're from, what the benefit of Jamie's would be. Um, feel to cover the, the so here it says, there's the art form. Ready, right. Now, that is a big job. That's a huge deep dive into what is going to make people come to this fish restaurant. It's going to, this is going to define how do you set up the marketing? Who is that person? So embark on this mission. Um, for Lily, FBR, Turner, Martin, Maven, you are tasked with creating a detailed profile for ideal customer of Jamie's, a restaurant focused on sustainable fish recipes. Here's how you might, might go about it. So it's laying out exactly what are the fears of the customer, underlying fears and aspiration, fears, concern about environmental sustainability, fear of contributing to overfishing, worry about the health and impact of food choices. So it's now lying, laying out for you step by step about what your customer will be worried about. This is creating your brand Bible for you then to create your content, brief your photographers, brief your designers. How long would that take you to do if you're starting a restaurant? 
or improving the restroom that you currently got. Now, you can take that same approach for any business. That's one, that's one thing that ChatGPT can do for you. I'm going to go back to the front bible and have a look at it. I will take one more, I think. So let's pick up one more. Um, we can do. I'm not going to write a recipe book today, but we could do that. Um, let's come down here. Um, webinar. These. Uh, so here, funnel planning, webinar funnel, planning. You can ask ChatGPT to write you a webinar. A, 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 a webinar funnel so, so so for example if you come here today you've come through a funnel a funnel is a series of web pages that helps you understand um uh, what you should be doing next um and really keeps people in um in the funnel so that you get maximum conversion the reason we've got so many people here today is you've run them through a funnel you've had emails you've had sms messages and our ai has helped us create that and all of these guides are here Um, literally sales page funnels here you go I'm not going to do another one of these lives because you can see how detailed they are but you this I'm, I'm on page 17 and we've already gone through everything you could possibly imagine so a podcast whether you'd like to set up Facebook ads for success um, everything you can possibly want is in here and I'm going to show you how you can get it but not only that I'm going to show you how you can personalize it so Got lots of questions here. Um, how do you know the information provided is correct and bangs it up to date? I heard everything is too long. That's a good question. So you've got a question. Somebody's asking um, about whether this information is bang up to date. Um, can I um, let you in a little secret? Um, AI is just like another person working for you. So in the same way, I don't know, but when, when, we, when we write um, a piece of content internally, um, whether it's human generated or AI generated, we always have a two sets of eyes policy where other people look at the content and sign it off. So when the AI writes you a piece of content, whether it is um, uh, writing email or writing a social post or writing uh, a strategy paper or writing a board paper, whatever it, is, whatever it is, you've still got to read it and fact check it as though you were doing it yourself. Now, what maybe is specializing in is helping people ensure exactly that problem works. So. How do you give it the information about your business so that it is bang up to date? So um, lady asked that question, hold on to your hats because we're going to demonstrate to you how you can really make that a safe, a save that, a make that question much safer. Um, because um, the, 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 they've also asked whether um, the chat GPT is being sued for people using their content. So one of the risks with chat GPT and really Thank you for raising this question because that's very much why we're here is that you you can feel nervous about do you want to give the ai your business information because if you give it does it go into the public domain and that is a very very valid question so stay for a while because we're going to then show you the absolute heart of what maybe does which is we provide secure personalized ai we make it really easy for companies to be able to get the value out of AI, but without taking the risk. Um, another question actually on who, how do we create the Front Bible? And we've, cre collect, we've created it through a large amount of the work that we have done working with um, going to other training. So we go and listen to a lot of other people's training. We've then tested it quite significantly. Um, and we've also refined a, a, a wide range of prompts that are, are publicly available. But we've also then run it through our personalized AI to train the AI to deliver a really valuable business result. So we have been using AI for about five years now. And as I said at the beginning, it's, it's all about the instructions you give it. You know, I'm getting better as I get older and I do feel very much older these days at the moment, um, about how I brief the team and encourage the team to, te team to deliver their best work faster. And AI is the same. You, you know, in my example at the beginning, you can say to the rest, you can say to AI, um, can I have a recipe for fish chowder? Or you can say to the AI, can you help me um, write a recipe for fish chowder and it get Jamie Oliver to improve it? So the prompt bible has been created after, so it's all of our learning, if you like. Um, um, is that that's probably the best way to answer it? And we're always adding to it because we're always learning. It doesn't, this thing doesn't stop. It's like having sort of a brilliant child 
I mean, in your midst. And if you don't keep learning from it, you're getting left behind. So the everything we give you gets continually updated because everything changes. Every time there's a new release of AI, it impacts all the tools out there that use it. We're constantly updating what we offer. So absolutely, you'll get access. You accept the offer at the end of this, you'll get, get access to the prompt guide. But, and remember, the guide is not just for use with GPT, it can be used with BARD. Um, and uh, and that, that really is, is critical to understand that is that ChatGPT is just one of the AI products out there. It's, it's the, but it's also the beating heart of many of the other products. So don't be, don't, don't listen to the fear mongers. Um, there are a number of questions actually around, is, uh, is, is there likely to be more than I think soon ChatGPT using content? So the questions around, you know, is it should you let ChatGPT use your content? Is the, the 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 brutal truth is if your if your content is out there on the web, it's it's out there, it's public, and what what ChatGPT and Bard and many other um, large language models like it is using that data to fuel their AI in the same way that Google uses it to fuel search. So the world is moving fast. AI is consuming information, and then you're you're able to query it to get an answer back. That changes the way that you create content. It changes the way business is done. The genie's out of the bottle. The, the wheel has been released, and we've got to learn how to use it. So yes, there will there will, will be new regulation around it. But the critical thing is how does your business use it? How does your business use it safely? And how do you, as part of a business team, use it to ensure that you are doing your best work faster because chat GPT is just one of thousands of new AI tool, tools available. Some of them are really not very good. Others are absolutely game changing. Key is to learn which one to use. So uh, at the beginning of this, when I said, you know, who's using um, AI, lots of you said you're using it for social posts and content because content is how you get the attention on the web. You know, you, you uh, most of you are here because you saw an ad, um, that had some, that's, we got your attention somewhere, we stopped the scroll. Um, content is the fuel of how you get people to come and see you. But it's just the beginning of a massive process. We've all signed up to something. We've all signed up to something that we can't get off this thing. Now. Um, and content begins the journey. You've then got to capture people's attention. You've got to sell to them. You've got to upsell. And you've got to stay in touch. Um, and that's, you know, we've, we've, we've got this phone in our hands. And there are so many touch points that you have to have with brands. AI has now meant that content is so easy to create, but you've got to create it really well. AI can create really great content or it can create really great content, stick about, because there is no social, let's say you something in a minute, that is going to blow your socks off. Because everybody in an organization is now going to be part of this journey to capture you uh, and, 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 that content has to live with you all the way through that journey. And AI can really help, help make that happen. So maybe as a business, we've now integrated masses of other services within our platform so that rather than having to go and use AI separately, you can use it alongside your CRM, in your email program, in your social media program, so that it all lives within it and it knows who you are um, and it's secure. It's not releasing your data to chat with GPT, it's keeping your data private. Um, we've also learned that in order to master digital and get it, get, it, get it working for you and delivering value to you and properly delivering value, you need to have help. So everything we do has this big chat button beside it that delivers support 24 seven, um, whether, whether it's about how to use AI or how to deploy AI so it delivers value. Now, Sarah is now going to show us how personalized AI means that your data remains secure and your data is not open to ChatGPT. And a number of you are really concerned about this. And don't let that be a reason for not using AI because AI is going to change our worlds. It's changing our world already. It changed the way we deliver support. Anybody that works with us has already experienced our 24-7 support, literally, you can ask us a question anytime, day or night, and you get the most extraordinary answer. And that's all powered by AI. Those that take us up on the offer at the end of this call, at the end of this session, will learn also how they can do the same. So in letting something like GPT 
read your website, you can deliver 24 seven support incredibly easily. And I can show you all how to do that if you join me for the offer at the end of this. It's not, it, it is just mind blowing what AI can do for you now. So Sarah, are you ready? Absolutely. I need to take over the screen if that's okay. Absolutely. So Sarah's going to take over the screen um, and she is going to introduce you to um, maybe AI, which really addresses the concerns that some of you begin to raise about how can you keep your data safe. So we know that the hardest thing with GPT is to ensure that it sounds like you. So what we have done is build, build a product within our suite of tools that have social media management, um, blog posting, website management, CRM, all of those, all of those important things, um, a, a, an AI that knows how to be you. So Sarah, are we going to, what, what business are we being today? I feel like I need a drum roll almost. Mm -hmm. um, but um, this is um, a, a Seven View Home Improvements, and they do um, building works, they do uh, windows, doors, things like that, conservatories. Um, and uh, they do great social, really good social media. Um, so, so, this AI has learned for it, it, you, 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 you sign up to the main platform and it automatically knows who you are based upon what you publish on social. And we are extending that brand capability. But, Sarah, let's, let's just give, it, give us a taste of what it will deliver for you. So, this is using pre written prompts from the Bible that you've already seen. Um, but it, the big addition is that it knows how to be you. Okay. Well, I thought I'd start with creating some social media content. Um, so I've come into this little menu uh, for writing great content and I thought, well, I'll go Instagram content creation. Uh, and I thought, should we go for some story ideas? Because actually it's, you know, one of the things that's so difficult is about understanding or, or, or you know, thinking about what should I post? You know, you can be a great big brand from a big marketing team, but actually that first question it's really quite difficult. So here we go. We've got some lovely story ideas here. I'm just going to move. I've got my little bar there. That's it. So here are some Instagram story ideas for Seven View Home Improvements. Showcase before and after transformation. So it knows that it's transforming homes. They know what they do. It's talking about them. Customer testimonials, snippets and reviews. Expert tips, share quick DIY tips or home improvement advice behind the scenes. Interactive polls, ask people about their preferred home upgrade options or favourite interior design styles or most desired improvement features. So everything is personalised. All the prompts talk back to you with advice and suggestions based on who you are and in your tone of voice. So uh, let's, I quite like the expert tips. So I'd like to create a series of five Instagram posts uh, that include. This is the hardest thing, having to type and, and speak. Um, and the hardest thing, the other person on the on the webinar starts to speak as well, and you get confused as well. So um, apologies if there, there are little gaps while we're typing, because it, it's really hard to get that bit right. Great job, Sarah. So well, Sarah, at least, at least everyone knows it's live, not pre. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just relieved I'm not doing it. So no. look at this. That's oh, amazing. Post one, inspired by the customer review post, enhance your home curbs appeal with stylish front door, highlight the importance for well-maintained. There you go. Post two, uh, maximising natural light in your home. Uh, post three, uh, who knew there was a Winnie the Pooh day post? Uh, but there, there is a Winnie the Pooh day. There's a day for everything and, and it will help you uh, create content in line with those bigger conversations, you know, like Mental Health Awareness Week and other conversations that you can get involved with. Um, sustainable home improvement, uh, organising decluttering. Brilliant. So I've got five posts here that I can 
put into my content scheduler and uh, and and put out there. Been written specially for me. They're all about me. Uh, they're going to drive me engagement. Amazing. Okay, so um, let's take it a little step further. Acting as a SEO expert, of which I am definitely not. Um, writing a blog, what keywords? So, Sarah, I'm just answering some questions while you're going, so don't listen to me, keep typing. So, questions around how um, applicable is this to B2B and highly technical products? Um, that, that's a great question, uh, because we are exactly that. So, we, we um, have used it massively for ourselves, and it, it doesn't mind whether you are a fish restaurant, um, a, a window a manufacturer or a highly um, technical um, product it, because it, it works off the information that you give it so the AI will will work for you it is it is like having a brilliant member of your team um, but what is important is that what we enable you to do is to, to, for, for, to learn to how to be you you fill in the gaps of the knowledge it doesn't have from the wider world, but the knowledge you give it is is safe in your environment. You're not sharing it with the wider world. So Sarah here, for example, has, has taken the, the stories that she asked it to create and said, now acting as SEO, SEO expert, give us keywords. And she's now going to ask them, uh, as an expert copywriter, write me a playful blog on the subject um, that is optimized for, um, um, for for SEO. But that this is about a window, um, uh, a seven view home improvement. It would work exactly the same for a highly technical B2B product. Um, that's the hardest thing to sort of get your head around is that it doesn't care and it will just keep delivering you delivering your answers and you can keep drilling down to get a better answer. Um, so Sarah, do you want to just talk step through what you've asked? Scroll back up. You take yeah. the stories that you gave. I've yeah, I've taken those. Uh, as an SEO expert, write a blog, uh, writing a blog, what keywords would you recommend? There you go these would be the ones that are valuable. So I've said, now acting as an expert copywriter, write me a playful blog on the subject that is optimized for SEO. Beautiful. Are you good at SEO, Sarah? No, <laughs> I am now. And you know what? What's that? Uh, it, it's allowed me to do my best work faster. That is for certain. But look at this, playful upgrades to your home with seven view home improvements. Welcome to the world of home improvement where creativity, comfort, coziness come together. We believe that every home deserves a touch of playfulness. And we're here to help you infuse joy and character into your living space. From reading nooks to sustainable solutions, let's explore how you can playfully upgrade your home. And, and there you go. You've got a fantastic blog and it's all optimised for SEO. So you've created the content, you've got a supporting blog, and it'll work for you. Boom. What are you going to show me next, Sarah? Well, taking the sustainability idea, um, I thought we'll go back into these other the uh, other prompts. There's loads of menus in here and all sorts of different things that you can already load it up. But I thought we'd go to sustainability and ethics. Um, just while Sarah's going there, I want to make clear that behind each of these is one of the, what I showed when I showed you that prompt, it's a big book. Behind each of these is each one of those already programmed into software um, with then your information on top of it. So you're getting that expert advice, but 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 already done. You haven't got to copy and paste anything and it knows your brand. Sorry, Sarah, off you go. No, no, it's fine. Don't worry. Um, so sustainable product ideas. I, I thought, well, OK, this is going to be interesting. So they talk about eco friends. They're obviously interested in sustainability as a business. So let's, what, let's see what they come up with for sustainable product ideas. Brilliant. Developing environmentally friendly and sustainable products is crucial in today's market. Where's that gone? That's magic. That, would, that disappeared. That's the joys of live. Go again. So so this is this the prompt that sits behind this will be acting as uh, an environmental expert based upon the content we're creating um, suggest um, sustainable product ideas um, and here you go so it's now okay. just give more detail actually so there you go so I thought it was really interesting 
Um, but actually, how am I going to communicate these products in my marketing strategy? Because these are really great ideas, but actually quite a lot of these we, we've already got. So it's about promoting it. So uh, how can we bring this to life in? Uh, uh, about how applicable it is to B2B highly technical products. You can start to see how, how this works. So based upon the information that you input at the start of this journey, um, this is where it starts to get really rich. So we're now asking to say, how can we bring this to life in a communication strategy? And there you go, boom. Boom, done. You okay, go by incorporating these elements into your common strategy, <clears throat> Seven View can position itself as a leader in eco-friendly home improvement solutions, attracting engaging eco-conscious customers. I just thought that was really, really interesting to see what that was going to deliver. And then um, finally, could you create a long form Facebook and LinkedIn? Uh, so just while Sarah's typing this, um, um, see how quickly you can go from idea to delivery. Um, and just to repeat, this can be on any subject matter. It can be anything from a nail bar through to a highly technical biotech company. Um, the AI just doesn't mind. So we're now asked it based upon its recommendations to create a long form um, Facebook and LinkedIn post and stories. Um, now, this is just a little tiny snippet of what you can do. So there you go, Sarah. Talk it, take it away. There you go. So uh, here you go. Long form Facebook post. Very sustainability with seven view home improvements. There you go. So I've come up, I've asked it for ideas. I've then asked it um, to, to how I can communicate it in my comms. And now it's delivering me the comms to support it and work, how long we've been talking about it. Less than two minutes something like that. So there you go, there you've got the range. There you've got the long form LinkedIn post. And then you've got a series of stories for Instagram. Now, Sarah, can you do, I haven't, I didn't, I didn't warn you about this, but I do love going off piece. If somebody said that's brilliant, but I'm not quite sure how to schedule a story. Let's say you've got a new member of your team and they've asked it and they've got this result, but they're not quite sure how to schedule a story. How could they then get that, that, that problem solved? Well, they'd use the magic blue button that sits within the platform and I'd say how do I schedule I've got your spelling jinx today <laughs> and Instagram story and then this is this is how we are using AI which is well we use it in many ways but this is one of the real business applications that we've done with it which is as we were growing and servicing 25,000 different businesses having enough people the knowledge to provide great support was really, really hard. Um, and in order to do that, we have literally used AI to deliver customer support. You've got an answer there in less than less than two seconds. Get click on the click on the article, it will take you to a full blown article on it and um, with a video and uh, you've got your answer. And this is how I believe AI is going to change business because not only can it help you create the content, you've then got the answer um, to get it. Now, no matter what kind of business you're in, particularly the technical ones that are on this call, to be able to service clients that fast is just incredible. So yeah. I'll, I'll take the reins back again, Sarah. That was an awesome demo. Thank you very much. Round of applause. Um, gosh, this is the scary bit. Um, I go to Zoom. Where are you? You're, oh, no. I've got to stop sharing, haven't I? It's, oh, gosh, 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 gosh. Right. Uh, you will stop sharing. I'm going to continue. 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 Um, I need to go to here. Share. Boom. Right, look at that. Seamless. Nearly seamless. Welcome back. Sarah, that's awesome. Thank you so much. Um, sure. So the challenge with all of this is, is how you um, keep the conduct orchestra playing in, in, one, in, in one tune. And so the reason that we're developing this, this kind of AI is so that you can keep your team on the same page because if everybody uses GPT differently, you get a very, you get a very out tune conversation but as you can see from what Sarah's done whether Sarah uses that tool or whether um, Harry uses it or I use it if you're in the account you're the AI knows how to be that business and that is the game changer um, because 
if you want your whole team to 2x their output, you need them to output it on in the same tune. Um, and we believe that, um, and that's why our focus is all on saying, how do we help businesses do this and be on brand and how do we do it and help them be secure in what they're doing? I've got a very special treat for you about the expert piece as well, because I'm gonna show you, Sarah hasn't even seen this yet. We've got some new stuff that we're doing with experts, um, which Holden Chat's gonna show you in a minute. Um, so as I mentioned, we, we believe that um, using AI for customer support is an absolute game changer. Um, and I would love to show you how you can do that for your business. And we have the technology to help you do that. Um, but if you choose to work with us, you've also got it. So you're never left in that moment of, well, how on earth do I do this thing? Because it's all very well learning how to create great content. You then got to learn how to distribute it. And there are so many questions. There are so many problems. Anybody that tells you there's a magic button that says, make make this work for my business tomorrow is lying to you. Can I just say that? I meant to say this at the beginning of this presentation, which is that anybody that says it's easy to nail digital marketing and AI and all the rest of it, it all happens by magic. Well, if you find that, could you please let me know? It comes down to work and it comes down to learning. But what AI can do is help you get there quicker. Um, everything we do is about getting that learning next to your problem. So that's why we've broken content down into tiny, tiny little bits. And whatever you ask for, you've got video and text content. We believe that the personalized AI that Sarah has just shown you, shown you is an absolute game changer. We haven't seen it anywhere else. And we're working on ways of you uploading more and more of your business content into a secure environment so that you can then use AI to get the results you need, get the content you need. And more than content, it's about getting strategy and how you can ask ex experts of the past to give their opinion on what you're doing. Hold on to your hats, we're going to show you that in a moment. We've got some lovely tools around content and creating, cal and creating calendars. We decided not to share this today because it just goes on for too long. But... This personalization literally will let you create content around, you, we, we show you what special days are going on, we know which brand you are, and you can create content whatever day of the year it is that's fun and engaging as well. Um, within the platform, you've got image AI, all of the things you can go and do with different AIs all across the web, they're all stuck in one place, makes it so much easier. Schedule content, um, use AI for running ads. We've taken um, all of the ads, whether they're Google, Facebook, TikTok, LinkedIn, YouTube and applied our AI to help you create the ads and help you create audiences. We're building a massive new piece around audience building and AI can help you reach the right customers with the right content. And we want to train you how to do that. Um, Bill, doing all this stuff and creating great content is then about how you capture people's content. You'll have gone through one of our funnels. These tools can all be available for you as well because there's no, no point in generating great content and generating great demand if you then don't talk to people and follow them up effectively. So build landing pages, automate everything. You've experienced these automations. So all of the tech, you'll get a text after this. I know you'll get a text after this, but I won't have to press a button. And it's all through the automations that are powered through the maybe platform and all the content can be written by AI. You have to know that it's working. So reporting is an integral part of it um, because you're here to make more money as a business owner. As a team member, you're here to help contribute to that bottom line. And you've got to know, is the AI helping me? Is it helping me deliver my results? So all of that AI, all of that reporting needs to be carefully integrated. Um, so this is a game changer. It doesn't matter what other platforms you're already using, being able to use personalized AI is something that I think can change the way you work. And I would like to teach you how to do that. So, um, but it's not just me, or this is the secret bit. Sarah, you haven't seen this. We are working at the moment about programming Steve Jobs into our personalized AI. Um, that means that you can ask Steve Jobs for his advice on what does your content sound like? He was the most amazing orator, the most amazing um, way, per person for storytelling. And that means that anybody can apply somebody like Steve Jobs or Seth Godin, who is another great of, of UX to their content, to their strategy. Um, all of that has been baked in with literally, I've seen the first beta release before this webinar. And so I popped it in. Um, and we're all the time creating more and more AI like this, which I think is just brain, just just incredible. We want to stop this moment. We know, I've been through it, I still have it now sometimes. But how the hell do you make this thing work? And that's why we're using AI to deliver support. And for your business, no matter what you're doing, you should be using AI for content and for support. I want to show you how you do that. So this is the bit where I'm going to tell you what the offer is. 
maybe it's a solution that takes the guesswork out of connecting with your customers digitally. And we've done that by bolting together a whole range of tools from content schedulers, email marketing, CRM, and this magic personalized AI that we're working on right now. People love it, um, but we know you haven't got hours to spend. We're very grateful for the hour you spent with us today and thrilled there are so many of you there. Um, Sarah, thank you for tuning through the question. Because there are so many, um, keep firing those back to people. Um, but you have an hour to spend. You can do your best work faster, but you need to use AI to automate content creation. It will translate content. It will let you go multinational with your business without having to learn different languages. You can get AI to write ads and deliver skills you you haven't got. You've seen Sarah creating SEO content. AI, AI can write ads for you. Um, it can then sh it can then then look at your results and say what well, you need to do better. And we believe you need to do that with it all in one place. At the moment, the rest of the world is tending to say, oh, have lots of different tools and now use lots of different AIs and then copy and paste it all back into one place. And it's just such hard work. Um, you can go to our website right now and you can buy this off the page, but don't. I want to offer you something better. Go and buy this off the page if you want. Um, you can try it for 14 days and then at 97 pounds a month, you can access all our social tools plus AI. 197 months, you can access every single business automation tool, blogging, websites, funnel building, you name it, the whole shebang. It's all in there um, and the personalized AI. But um, I want to talk to you about the thing that will make the difference, the thing that will make you get to six figures a month or more, wherever you are, we want to double it, treble it. And you can do that by joining us for our business intensive. This is a brand new course, it lasts for six weeks. We're just launching it. And it's taking everything we've learned from those businesses that have already achieved amazing results. And we wanna hold your hand through creating a digital sales process using AI tools. We deliver weekly live learning sessions and daily specialist catch-ups. So you're never stuck. You've got access to the people that can help you do the work you need. You'll learn how to use AI and automation to transform your business. You've got everything you need in one place, no matter what platforms you already use. I'm not asking you to give up the platforms you're already using. I'm saying to you, come and learn to use AI and think about how you take that and put it into your existing platforms. Or I'd like to tempt you to actually say it's much easier to do it in one place. All the time through this, you've got access, access to ex ex expert help 24 seven. The business intensive is a six week course that runs through the key elements that matter. So introduction to AI and digital marketing, personalizing your communication with AI, optimizing social media and ad campaigns, Contact, man contact management and CRM tools, automating marketing business processes and implementing scaling with maybe. That's when we say to you, come on, come and do it all in one place. Um, we want to solve this with you. We'll take you step by step through the six weeks so that you get to the point where you have nailed your content, your capture, your sell, your upsell, your follow up. And if you've got the tools for each of your team to be able to do this well, um, this is a very special offer. It's available to you today but it's not available for very long. So there are very limited spaces. The charge is 995 per person. It's only available to people that come in this masterclass and you get a ton of bonuses. Now I find this doesn't come very easily to me. I'm not a natural seller, but I'm really excited about this masterclass because you're getting everything that it's taken us years and years to deliver to people like a law and company and uh, um, and Sophie Scarrett, who are literally smashing on digital. We've taken all of that and bundled it up into our AI support. Um, and we're providing you with a maybe account free of charge for 60 days and an absolute expert set up on it. So you just get off the race and start. You get the 150 page um, prompt Bible that we showed you at the beginning of the, um, as, as when we started off doing the fish restaurant and you've got upstate, updates to that forever. You'll get lifetime access to all intensive recordings and training and prompts, and we keep updating that. Um, you've got live expert support all the way through the six weeks. Um, you've got early access to new features um, if you choose to remain a maybe client. And if you choose to remain a maybe client, you can help determine what we build next. And that's like giving you access to your own dev team. You get to be the ones that say, do you know what? It's not just Steve Jobs I'd like help from. I'd like help from this expert or whatever it is. Imagine having a team at your disposal, and that's what you've got with this. You've got access to us to help you in six weeks transform the way you approach marketing and digital communications, because we've been, we've lived that transformation. In fact, I would say we're living it because it changes every day, and we will help you and your team 
make that leap as well. So choice is yours, really. You've just got to decide what wheels you're going to put on your truck. How quick are you going to go? Because this train has left the station and we are all running to catch up. Those that put the fast wheels on will take the benefit. But it's not about slogging it out by yourself because you need a team. We are invested in this. We're learning about it all the time. These are the real people. You've met Sarah today, but Hannah will send you. Hannah manages our customer support. Fiona is our resident ads expert and is singularly responsible for how those two businesses we've, we've, we've just mentioned today have transformed their ads. Her knowledge is baked into everything we do. And you can meet her weekly and ask her, what's wrong with my campaign? How do I make it better? Emma is our chief product officer and is the one that is creating all of our tech. Not only do you get access to our AI, you get access to people that are building it and to learn what's making it work. It's secure, it's safe, and we want to show you how to make it work for your business. So your choice, you can go and access our tech off the page, but you will not get this level of support. This is a really, really unique offer that we're only keeping open for a very short window of time we want to help you um, put AI and automation at the heart of your business. We can't do this for all of our clients. We've opened it up at the beginning of this year um, and we had such a great demand. We've put more resource behind it now to provide it and make it open to more businesses. But you do need to go and book it within the next 24 hours. Um, please go to maybetech.com forward slash go. Um, Sarah will drop, drop that in the chat as well for you so it's easy to pick up. That's maybetech.com forward slash go. Um, I've got lots of questions coming in, in on it. Um, and there's loads of questions coming in and really good ones too. Um, so we'll, we'll just leave this up at the moment for you to consider it. Um, I promise you, AI is not going away. If you adopt it, all of your team will deliver twice the output at the very least. If you start to learn how to use it well, you will be doing five times the work quicker than you can possibly imagine. It is so empowering. But I think alongside that is the demands that are now being placed upon all of us to get good at stuff that is not our natural thing is huge. And if you can use it to get better quicker and understand how your team can deliver a better result faster, it's an absolute game changer. So. Um, go to mabytech.com forward slash go if you want to grab a place. They are limited. They're not going to be available forever. Um, if you've got any questions, drop them in the chat and we'll start going through the questions now and we'll stick on this page. Um, Sarah, um, shall we go through the Q&A? Um, yeah, think... so I think the biggest question that lots of people are asking is the six weeks, where, where does the training take place and, and, and what does it look like? Oh, great question. So... There's a membership area where we release the training once a week. We, we have thought long and hard, and we're going to take feedback on this, about whether we release it all at once. But the reason we're doing it in six-week chunks is we're doing it on Zoom. You don't have to come and see us. It's on Zoom. Um, it will be a two-hour session, and the first one starts on the 1st of February, and it's from 3 until 5 o'clock. It will all be recorded, um, and um, it will, I will run it with the team, so I will be there, and there will be we'll bring a number of experts with us, um, and we'll show you... Um, the the why um, it matters and then show you how to execute it. So in each topic, there'll be there will be a real piece of well, why does this matter? How can it really change my business? And then how do you do it? There'll be a little bit of homework. As I said, it will all be on Zoom. You'll have access to the recordings. And in each ses session, there will then be access to all of the help files um, that connect you to our experts 24-7 to execute that piece. Now, the key thing is that this doesn't, this training doesn't go away, is once you've gone through it, you've then got access to it forever. So whilst you go through the training, you won't have to remember it or think, oh gosh, actually there's something I need to come back to. You haven't got to take notes. I've been on so many trainings where you spend the whole time scribbling and you never go back to it. This is about you buy access, but then you've got access forever. Um, because this, this stuff's hard. And we will update you so it doesn't go out of date. The training, you get access now, and then as you go through it, it will continue to update after you've gone through it the first time. Sarah, did that ask that question? Is that covered off? It seemed quite a lot of people asking something similar. Yeah, that was hopefully not. It's pretty articulate. Yes. 
absolutely. Um, another question on, do you will you cover ads? Yes, absolutely. So um, topic three is all around optimizing social media and ad campaigns. And we will go through both how to use Facebook, um, all the meta suite, and also touch on Google um, and other channels as well. So within the major platform, there's an ads module that enables you to do that. And we will cover all of those. Um, and you know, also you can bring your bring what you're doing and ask us to help you improve that. Or if you've never started out, and um, we'll show you where to get started. Remember, everything has got baked in AI. So you've got a massive head start um, in order to be able to um, get going really quickly. So it doesn't matter whether you are already good at this or whether you want to get started, this will work because the AI works with you. And then on top of that, you've got a bunch of, of humans that really, really are on your side and help make it work. Um, question of the prompt Bible. Yes, you'll 100%, everybody that buys this will get access to the full fat prompt Bible, Bible that, we, that, that we live and die by. Um, we update it, you know, if I go to some more training somewhere else, um, and see, think that's really great. Um, we might amend and add that to it. If we go and see something um, or, or, or something that we've embedded within the platform, we'll add that too. But all of that prompt Bible is also baked into the maybe platform that you will get access to that knows how to be your brand. And that makes it even more powerful because it means you haven't got to tell it how to be you because it knows how to be you. Um, I'm, Sarah, I'm my phone, is your phone going nuts with how many with, with people uh, come? <laughs> yes. And I've got notifications coming in from yeah from Stripe as well. So yeah, so we'll go. Thank you. It's very exciting. Um, yeah. There's still lots of people here and um, lots more questions uh, around um, what's the difference between the Social Plus account and the business account. If I've got Social Plus, can I upgrade to business with this plan? Oh, absolutely. So yeah, so actually, that's great to see some of uh, Sony clients on here too. Um, so so this is all about if you've got Social Plus plan, um, you one hundred percent we will we will uh, we'll talk to the team. Sarah or the team will upgrade you as part of this plan. Um, and this is this is about providing you with all the knowledge and access to information that will absolutely help you leverage the tools you've got in your account. Um, we, you know, the difference between the Social Plus account and the Business account, with maybe, is that the Business Plus account has got every tool you could ever imagine. You probably won't use half of them, but the ones that you do need to use um, are will transform your business. Um, you know, we appreciate that every business has different needs at different time, and we thought about having a really complex pricing structure, and then decided, you know what, let's just make it available um, because everybody needs things at a different time, and it's so hard going off and sticking everything together with tape by having different platforms. Um, our job is to keep them all up to date. Your job is to use them. And this is about making sure that you've got the knowledge to make sure that they are connected to your business and that your business really does have, that it can transform itself. We, we our, our, our new, our, our sort of wording for this year, the way we talk about ourselves is that we help businesses trans transform their communications. And we mean that, that's what we do. Um, this is about giving you the knowledge to connect you to the tools um, and use the AI so that you can deliver the work that you've never dreamed of doing. I, I'm constantly amazed by my output now, Sarah. Um, I, I think you feel the same way, don't you? Uh, oh, honestly, I mean, our, my whole team, we, we, we are definitely five times in five, five times in our output. Um, certainly over the last six months, we have been able to grow uh, what we deliver exponentially without actually having to add more members to the team. Um, but now we've all learned how to use all these tools to do our best work faster. And we're, we're going to invest in more people actually to do the same as us, to grow even bigger. So it's just... Um, it's, it's completely transformed me. And and I, I just thought, you know, at the age of 50, oh, dear, I don't know about this. Oh, gosh, what do I press? I mean, I can't even change the channel on the television. Uh, I wish chat, I wish AI could do that for me, actually. Um, but my goodness me, I mean, have all these tools transformed our business? Definitely. Definitely. Uh 
and Sarah, you raised a good point there about um, it, it. You know, it doesn't matter where you are in your journey. It's this works whether you are an expert or whether you're just at the beginning. Um, and we're gentle with you. Don't 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 feel that you've got to be at a level to be able to start this. Um, the team, Sarah's one of uh, a very lovely team. Um, I will I will I will be on the trainings, but so will we've got specialists in different subjects. So from for example for ads, we've got a team who have proven time and time again to be able to deliver extraordinary results for businesses and they will help you achieve that too. So this business intensive is is about using AI, not just for the hell of it, but to deliver a business result. Um, I think it is an incredible opportunity to really um, accelerate your business and um, or, or as a team member to, to start to deliver value that you that is incomprehensible to be honest. Um, but but not by doing masses more work, just by being a whole lot smarter. So please, um, d people are jumping on. Um, just and also just let us know in the Q and A. So great to see so many people are still here. Um, I appreciate we've gone over time. Anybody that wants to stay, please keep asking questions. We'll keep going through them through them. But go to maybetech.com forward slash go, um, and just grab this opportunity because we are. You know, I'm going to be invested in it. The team are invested in it. We want to see you succeed. Um, but it won't be open forever. Um, it's a question here around the automation piece. Um, yes, so so we've got automations around SMS, as you've experienced with um, this web, this this masterclass. You've had people that you've had text. We'll show you how to do the same for your business. Um, and uh, the question about the customer support. Yes, so from a customer support perspective, we will show you how to use AI to read your website, read your blogs, and then deliver the same chat-based um, uh, responses that we deliver via our website where you can answer questions automatically. But you can also extend that to Facebook and to Meta um, so that you can answer your DMs and um, SMSs automatically with AI. So um, yeah, it's really wide ranging what we cover and it's not it's not theory, it's Estimate fact. Service. Yeah, it's, it's not theory, it's fact. We can Sorry show you it deployed all the time. Sorry, Sarah, off you. No, I was just going to say about what massive um, difference it's made to our customer service um, since we've built AI into, into the chat. We get approximately 350 inbound inquiries a day through our chat. Um, we actually only have to service, as in, with a human, about 6% of those. Um, and it's just extraordinary, the quality of the the, the content that it, it, it delivers. And I'm sure you will find once once you're in and you're using uh, the, the, uh, the tools and coming to the masterclasses that the support that's there uh, and provided by our AI is, is absolutely exemplary. Uh, and we'd like to show you how you can do the same thing for your business. Just, it's just worth saying, actually, somebody said, does that mean that we don't get to speak to people? Um, so the uh, the AI means that you, get, that you get signposted immediately to the right content, and it is really, really good. Um, the, the key thing is that everything is also monitored by human um, and um, also by sentiment. So if we see somebody getting stuck, we jump in, and also the AI passes it off us to us. Uh, it pass is, passes it off to us. So this person need help in the same way that we will show you how to do that in your business. All of this is about showing you what we do and showing you how you can do it in your business, because I promise you, it will enable you to 2x the input of all of the team at the very least. So whether you are running a company or whether you're part of a company, at least one of you should do this course and then decide who else needs to do it. Um, um, I'm I'm staggered, Sarah. How how um, how many people are jumping this? Thank you so much for coming today. I don't want to take too much of your time, but please don't miss this chance. We'll sell it. We'll send a recording of this webinar out. Um, the link to go to to jump on the business intensive is maybetech.com forward slash go. Um, I think uh, Sarah will take the rest of the questions and answer them. It's just another question saying when does it start? Yeah, the business intensive starts on the 1st of February. Um, if for any reason, you know, you can't make it, it is recorded and all sessions are recorded um, and you'll be able to attend live, whether you attend live or um, on catch up. 
and our support, the 24 seven support, yes, it's run by AI. Yes, it's watched by a person. You need to talk to us, you can. And we run live expert sessions with real people every day as well. So the time commitment is there's a two hour session that is once a week. And then you've got access to us 24 seven and you've got a daily session with an expert where you can ha bring bring your ads, your web pages, your emails and ask for help. Um, thank you so much. And we really do look forward to helping you and your team do your best work faster. Um, thank you for joining us. Um, please follow us on social. And um, yeah, see you again very soon. Thank you so much. Don't forget, go to mabytech.com forward slash go. I promise you, we'll change your world and see you very soon. Thank you.